Hey guys, <clears throat> hey guys, welcome to this video. Um, in this video, I'm going to show you how to save your settings uh, or strings or whatever you want to call them. Um, so I'll preview this in a Windows Forms application. Uh, let's call this Save Settings and press OK. Um, so this um is actually pretty cool I I think there are or I know two uh, ways to do this um, it's using the built-in uh, uh, thing I'm going to show you right now and the uh, registry uh, thingy I think I'm going to make a different video about it but I don't know um, so just comment if you want uh, if you want a tutorial about that so I'm just making a cool box <laughs> so call button 2 to delete I'll delete and save oh wait a second just name this one reset <coughs> so I call I uh, just leave it like that by the way so go to project and save settings uh, properties or your project name and then uh, uh, properties now I go to application and make sure this is checked and make sure this one is checked so it says save my dot settings on start a uh, shutdown I mean so make sure that it's checked or yeah just uh, uncheck it I mean so now I go to settings uh, so here you see name so I'm going to uh, type in um, YouTube tutorial it is going to be a string you can also use uh, uh, things like a uh, let's see uh, uh, much thingies a font a point color uh, string collection, string, single, short, as byte, long, integer, double, decimal, date, char, byte, and boolean, uh, and more stuff. But I'm just using this, and you can check this. I actually don't know what this means. I just uh, uh, check user. So value is going to be nothing f uh, for the time being. Then, uh, so I save it. Wait a second, yeah, just save it all if you want to. Uh, so now I go to reset. And then I'm going to type in, um, wait a second, uh, in the uh, form 1 uh, <coughs> class, I'm going to type in dim. Uh, let's see, settings, settings, as, and then new. New my dot my settings like that so now we can just use it settings dot dot youtube dot equals to nothing and then settings dot save like that and <clears throat> I think you know the code behind this button and that's going to be settings dot youtube dot equals to text box one dot text <coughs> and then settings.save so when I I uh, wait a second uh, actually it doesn't matter maybe you want to add a uh, that the text box will be cleared when you press reset but okay so let's type in hello YouTube hope YouTube so save and when I run it again I've forgotten something lol um so um double click on the form so you get the form load and you go to type in text box one dot text equals to settings dot youtube tut so as as it works fine it should look like this so when I press reset and I play it again it will be clearer uh, let's say uh, this was made by GNBJBK save 
and now we choose this reset and again and now it's cleared so uh, I think uh, it also used the registry but I actually don't know um, so uh, you can look it for you can look for yourself if you want to know that <coughs> I'm just too lazy for that um, so uh, actually it's pretty easy um, uh, but the registry uh, thingy uh, in the registry is just a little bit difficult to understand and I'm going to make a video about that uh, if you guys want uh, again so if you want a tutorial about that just uh, leave a comment uh, uh, below this video uh, or on my channel or PM me or, or just contact me or let me know that you want a uh, tutorial about that so um yeah thanks for watching uh, this tutorial um so um please uh, subscribe to me rate this uh, video comment this video comment my other videos view my channel and stuff so uh, thanks again and i'll catch you later